thought you'd bring that pretty little face over here for a kiss. Oh, you're breaking my heart, sugar pie. <laughs> You're a real charmer, ain't you? Just the merry dance of the sexes. Creep. What the hell are you doing? I'll kill you. Okay, well, let's talk more later. All right then, cowpoke. How about you keep me company? Really, Mr. Bell? You flatter me. Tell me some stories oh, about when you was young and pretty before time ravaged you. Oh, you horrible <laughs> man. <laughs> That's right. Mm. Hi there. How you keeping, Abigail? Just fine. I never, uh, never told you this, but you're quite a woman. Thank you. Quite a woman. You can make a fella real happy. Bet you know how. I got work to do. <clears throat> you're a sneaky one, Morgan. I know your type. Don't mind me. Bye now. That idiot. About as charming as a slug. You let me know if it gives you any more hassle. All right, well, I should be getting on. I imagine you was quite something once, Miss Grimshaw. Thank you. Yes, a long time ago. We all know flowers wither. Ain't no shame in it. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Mmm. You know, Miss Grimshaw, I bet you were a tiger. In your day. Bye now. Get up, Reverend! Get up! Mind if I sit? Guess not. Oh. <sighs> so, Abigail, how about you and I go into town sometime? I'm afraid mother and don't leave me much spare time, Mr. Bell. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Well, uh, if you change your mind, I'd show you a real good time. Real good. And, uh, I've always fancied fathering. The boy has a father, Mr. Bell. If you say so. If you say so. Come along, Jack. Lost my appetite. <laughs> Cowpoke, she ain't yours. <clears throat> Don't you have nothing better to do? I'm just being friendly. No, you ain't. On this beautiful night, Will you dance with me, Miss Mary Beth? No, I will not. You're... I got two left feet. I'm not a monster, miss. No, of course you're not. You're not that interesting. Very funny. That's quite a gun you got there. Sure. Something about watching you clean it. You 
Gets me all hot and bothered. I love it. You'll not charm me, Mr. Bell. <laughs> I'll certainly try. Hmm? <laughs> people the wrong idea and what would that be that I like you <laughs> no only thing you like is a bottle of whiskey everyone knows that Miss Karen they do oh yes some folks is concerned but not me your past worrying about nasty little thing she gets what she deserves What a horrible little piece of shit that feller is, Arthur. I couldn't agree with you more. Like hell's gift to women. You got that right. Anyway, I won't disturb you. We ain't doing that. I mean, why the hell do we need a gaggle of girls who won't even fuck you if you put a gun to their head? I'm sure you've tried. Is it too much?